Did I forget to turn the water off in my sink? We're not going for that experience ever again. On 135. Oh, please. Hi, everybody. Welcome back. Dehydrating with Michelle. Today is dehydrating with Michelle. What are we going to dehydrate today? First of all, let's start here. Did you see the video where I dehydrated the bananas? If not, you need to watch that. You really need to watch that because you know what? It was a fail and I'm learning. I'm learning from that. I will link that video in my description. We're probably at the end. There was a lot of smoke involved in this and it smelled really bad. So go watch that video. So first things first. Since I did the bananas yesterday and was disgusted with the bananas that I did yesterday, go watch the video. We are now washing the trays. They're going to soak. Some of them are soaking already. I'm going to wash these trays, get them ready for the marshmallows. Would you like to see a sneak peek of the bananas? Let me take you to my window. Hmm. You see that out there? Those are the bananas. Well, sitting next to the cast iron skillet that was also with the bananas. You want to know why? Go watch the video. So I'm going to wash these trays and I'll get right back with you. I'm excited to hydrate today. I'm really excited to do the dehydration thing again. When you fall off the horse, you jump back on and you ride some more. Did I forget to turn the water off in my sink? Why, yes. Yes, I did. I did that. I heard my well going and I'm thinking, why is the well going? And I'm thinking, oh, the water. I left the water on in the kitchen sink. Oh, that would have been another catastrophe. Can you imagine me calling my husband and saying, um, honey, I over, I flooded the kitchen. He would have killed me. He would have killed me for sure because you know what? It smelled in this house pretty bad last night. And that's all we need is another dehydrator fail. Maybe I should just go back to bed. The trays are dry. Got them out of the sink, wash clean, dry. You want to know why I know they're dry? I put them in the dehydrator and turned them on. You know, I figured, what's the difference between the dishwasher drying them and the dehydrator drying them? There is none. All right, I've got the marshmallows. Marshmallows, right here. Marshmallows, got those. I got one bag, two bags, three bags. Three bags of marshmallows. So I thought, we could do this. I could do this. I know that I can do this. We're not going to have the same experience we did with the bananas. We're not going for that experience ever again. The trays are dry. I know that. I can't mess this up. I, I can't. We're not having another failed video. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not having another failed dehydration experience. Hold on. I need scissors to cut the bag. Scissors. Scissors, got the marshmallows, and we're going to do this. So, I'm going to do them on 135. Oh, please. Just hold on a minute. I can't. I just can't right now. I just can't. Let me move these. I'm back, and that was okay. Sometimes things just happen. So, they're going to go in the holes. I know they're going to go in the holes. We're going to hope I don't step on those marshmallows <laughs> as I'm doing this. <laughs> I just can't. All right. These are going to be good. I know they're going to be good. They smell good. They're going in the holes. We're going to spread them out here nicely. Can you see me doing, I'm spreading them out. All right, hold on. I'm going to get another tray. Hold on. Okay, now remember in my, my last video, if you watched my banana video, there's a flat, there's this side and there's that little thing. See the little thing? Put that down. Your trays will go together much better. I'm going to carefully dump these out. I hope these aren't too small when they dehydrate. I hope I don't need to be using the screens. I don't, I don't know. They're going to be like little ants. They're falling through. Oh my gosh. We are going to do this. 
you know they're falling through the little hole but I'm I'm, I'm just gonna leave them in there because I'm just doing that I probably could fit some more on this tray huh. Let me see. I'm just having a day I'm just having a day we have flavored marshmallows too and I bet you if this is good flavored marshmallows might be good too I'm gonna go get another tray. I put them away from me, the tray, so I wouldn't knock them over again. <sighs> okay. There we go. All right, now I need another bag. I think I'm only gonna do two bags, just two. And we're gonna carefully open this bag because we are. It's really humid and raining in Ohio still, but I don't think, carefully, these shouldn't take but maybe six to eight hours, maybe. I don't know. I've never done this before, so we're learning together. Again, we're learning together. And I know it's humid because my hair is going, probably just spit on the marshmallows. All right, one more tray. It's on there. Here we go. I have one more tray I could put in here and I'm going to I'm going to utilize that tray for the little bit I have left. I stepped on a marshmallow. It stuck to my sock. That's okay. That's okay. I have more socks. I can change them. I'm doing laundry. That one fell through the hole. It's like a game. Woo! See if you can make it in the hole. Oh, that one hit the floor. One more. One more. That one went in the hole and hit the other tray. Here's all the marshmallows lined up. There you see them lined up. All right, let's go get the lid. The Nesco settings are on the machine. And we're going to do the fruit and vegetable setting. We're going to, you know, start there. If I have to turn it up, I will. But I won't do that until I message a pro. Probably Paige Family Homestead will hear from me again today about these marshmallows. And they have a hashtag, hashtag let's dehydrate. If you tag your dehydration video with hashtag let's dehydrate, she will put it in a playlist on her channel so we all can dehydrate together. We're all learning together. Oops, I better turn it down. I didn't do that yet. Um, where's one? Th oh, there it is. That would have been bad if I would have forgot the setting after I just told you about the setting. We're going to leave these go. It's 1142 in Ohio on this humid rainy day. I'm going to get the marshmallows off my floor right now and change my socks. And we'll be back in two hours. It's me back with another marshmallow check-in. Let's check on the marshmallows to see how they're doing on this bright, shiny, rainy day. I'm going to unplug the machine. Let's see what we have. Oh, look. They're like puffing up. Mm hmm. Oh, you know what? They're puffing up first, like you would put them in the fire and they puff up. I bet you that if I would get the bigger marshmallows, here we go. Ideas with Michelle graham crackers and chocolate. If I would put big marshmallows in this thing for like maybe an hour they would puff up to make s'mores we can make s'mores out of this we can make s'mores i know we could do that look for that video in the future note to editing michelle make a note of future video now we're gonna um um rotate rotate that's the word i'm looking for we are going to rotate these trays so let's do that Oh, you know what? While I rotate the trays, I can all the all the marshmallows that I tossed through the hole, I can pick up. Look at these. I hear these are really good. Probably as long as I keep them out of my oven, they'll be they'll be great. I'm telling you, if you haven't seen the banana video, you need to go see that. I got so freaking frustrated that day. Well, two days going into more that it was just you know once something gets too stressful or too much i just laugh i just laugh and then when the smoke was pouring i just laughed even more 
Although my husband didn't find it too funny me laughing of the house filling up with smoke. Smelly smoke, that is. Like toxic, stinking smoke. Okay, there's the marshmallow check-in. I'll be back in a couple hours and we'll look at this again. It's me again and we're back. I just got a hold of Peggy from Patriomly Homestead. The setting should be 160. She suggested that, so we're gonna we're gonna turn it up because I had it at 135, but I I don't know what I'm doing. They're still poofy. They're poofy. S'mores. Look for that recipe. It's coming. I'll be back in a couple of hours. It's time for another check. Marshmallows. Marshmallows. We're doing marshmallows. I just ate one, and they're really good. They like melt in your mouth. For real. They melt in your mouth. This is much better than I thought it would be. So I'm going to rotate my trays. And I bet it's not going to be much longer and these are going to be done. I thought they would shrink smaller for some reason. But they're not. And I've heard that when you do marshmallows, people that um, make their own marshmallows... I don't even know how to do that. I'm not even going to do that. When they dehydrate them, they melt, but when you do the store-bought ones, they stay like that. See? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Bad move. Well, we'll check on these again in a couple hours, but so far, I'm happy with these. We'll be back. Good morning. It's the next day. I went to bed last night and we turned this off. We turned it off. I didn't want it running all night. It's marshmallows and I thought they would get really done. Let's check them. Let's see what they are this morning. It's 10.30 in the morning. I did plug them in when I got up this morning. Okay, we've got marshmallows happening. Oh, I don't... I don't think they're done yet. I'm gonna let these run today. I do know though last night they cooled down and they were half crunchy and boy are these are good. These are very good. These oh, these are really good. So I did go to bed with a handful of these last night. So I'm gonna let them run for a while today and then we'll check them later and let them cool down and I think they'll be good. I mean, look at these. Look at these. They're hard. Look. Look, they're hard. And there's powder on there. On the, you can see the powder. And I got bags for my parents. I have bags for my kids. Oh, they're going to love this. They're good. I love them. 